Good morning. Today we are going to a shrine for some kind of family event. It's not like really formal, but at least I'm wearing a jacket. Okay, so we made it. <laughs> there are actually quite many people today uh, for different reasons. There are actually many families with small kids because when the kids become three, five or seven years old, they usually come to this kind of shrine or temples. Yeah, so I drew this fortune telling paper. It says many good things. So for instance, it says when it comes to traveling, do slowly, business, good, incident, you will win. I don't really understand. Relationship, uh, trust your partner, moving as soon as possible. <laughs> Ah, so we got home. Uh, the sushi was really good. <laughs> and now uh, I have some work to do with my dad. So as you can see, we have some goldfish and my dad bought them like a few years ago. But then <laughs> one of them has grown so much. <laughs> it's like 20 centimeters, the big one. <laughs> and this cage is too small for <laughs> this one. So we actually bought new one today, new home for the goldfish so we are gonna do some moving work with my dad ちょっと<笑> By the way, I have been asked to show how our house in Japan looks like. So I'm gonna give you a quick home tour. I can't show you all of the places, but at least I can show you some features of this Japanese home.
これって。なんかもう消えたで、今。え、これ。うわ。笑顔がないよ。笑顔。いや、いや、おろそか。じゃ、もうおろそ、おろそ。じじじじじじ。ほら、来た、来た。さあ。誰 When I come back here for holidays, usually what I do on my last day is visiting these two shrines near my home. Actually, I'm flying back to Finland tonight. But my flight is 11.30 in the evening, so I still have lots of time today. <laughs> so now I'm walking to those shrines. And they're actually quite famous shrines with long history. <laughs> and one of them is actually the UNESCO World Heritage Site. <laughs> and I really like the atmosphere in this area. I'm not really religious, but visiting this place makes me really relaxed in a way and I can kind of get this kind of like a nostalgic feeling because this is a city where I grew up I think now I'm ready to go back to Finland I'm gonna start packing after getting home I still have time to go for some shopping so we might go somewhere to buy some food or something still Yeah, so I started packing. I packed pretty much everything what I have. I have some clothes, tea, rice cracker, chocolates, chestnuts, mayonnaise, bread, <laughs> all the different kind of stuff. I still have some space here. So <laughs> I think we are going for shopping now because there are still some space and uh, luckily this time I can uh, bring maximum 32 kilograms like each suitcases so I'm gonna buy some more rice maybe <laughs> Like one thing I realized when I come back to Japan, like every time is there are so many like elder people 
as you know, Japan is like a aging society, but <laughs> yeah, there are so many elderly people. So <laughs> it feels like I'm the only one young person here. <laughs> Okay, so I'm ready to leave for the airport. <sighs> uh, this is the end of this vlog, but I'm gonna film still. Luckily, I can take a business class when I fly back to Finland this time because I had a lot of mileage point. So I'm gonna film there as well to show you how the flight from Japan to Finland looks like. Anyway, thanks for watching this vlog and hope to see you in my next video. Moikka!